What's up YouTube today? I'm gonna to show you guys the best center build in NBA 2K23. Shout out to my guy Raymo, aka Mr. Relo Man. He's top three center in 2K history. If anyone knows about the best center builds, it's him. He's a 3v3 champ for the NBA 2K League, and he's a 2K Hall of Famer pretty much. So like this is the build he uses and the best build on 2K. So I'm gonna show you guys right here. And by the way, guys, I'm doing a jersey giveaway, my old fab NBA 2K League jersey. There's only three of them out there. I'm giving away all three of them. It's really rare to get 2K League jersey. So if you guys want to enter the giveaway, just put down number three in the comments. Put down three in the comments to enter, and I'll give away my jersey every week to a new winner. So make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Leave down three, but let's get right into the video. The best center build in NBA 2K23. Let's get right into it. So first of all, we're going to make him a center, obviously. Put whatever hand you guys want, whatever jersey number. We're going to do that. Then we're going to do 7-3. Make him 7-3. 249. 8 one wingspan. And we're going to do built body type. So we look really big. So right out the gate, we're going to do 96 close shot. We're going to do 96 close shot. Boom, boom, boom. Put that 96 close shot on. We're going to do 56 driving layup. Do the 56 driving layup. We're going to do the 70 driving dunk. Do a 70 driving dunk right here. We're going to do 80 stand dunk. Put the 80 stand dunk right here. And the 80 post control. So with that, we get we get the Hall of Fame post spin. We get the go drop step. Go drop step or go back down punisher pretty much. We get the... We get quick first step on Braun, so that's really key. So this is a really good build right here that Rainbow made. Close shot, 96 for Hall of Fame Fast Twitch. That's really OP. So that's really insane right there. We, we're going to do that. We're going to put our free throw to 59. And we're going to put our mid-range to 57. Up one so we get that one badge point for slippery off ball. We want that slippery, slippery off ball to get off screens quicker and make us move off the picks quicker. So shout out to that. Remember, you want the post control at 80, so you get that quick first step on bronze. You get that back down punisher. You get that post spin technician. You want that 96 close shot for the fast twitch on Hall of Fame. So let's get right into the playmaking. For playmaking, Rainbow put on 80 pass accuracy for the playmaking. He put 80 pass accuracy for the playmaking. He left his ball handle at 45. 80. That's good right there. So... He puts his interior at 82. You need some interior. 82 interior gets you Hall of Fame workhorse. So we see what, what he did there. He put his perimeter at 45. 45 gets that silver off-ball pest. I see what he did there. He put his steel to a 60. Let's see. He put his steel to a 60. Boom, right there. Max out of steel. He put his block to a 93. 93 block for that gold anchor. He put his offensive rebound on 94. Boom. He gets that Hall of Fame box. What I noticed about Rainbow's build is he doesn't run Hall of Fame rebound chaser. He doesn't really like it. He thinks Hall of Fame rebound chaser and go rebound chaser is the same. So that's very shocking right there. But he runs 94 for that Hall of Fame box up beast. Then he got 52 speed. Put that 52 speed up. 40 excel. He got 86 strength. He got 86 strength for that gold brick wall, which is very key for your guards. He got gold brick wall for his guards. He has 70 vertical. Then he has 90 stamina. Put that stamina to 90. All right, so this build right out the gate looks really, really good because to finish your layups and to finish in the paint as a big, you need a high close shot. And he has a very high close shot. He has a 96 close shot. So that's very key. Close shot goes for your post hooks too. So 7-3 post hooking everybody. Post hooks are very overpowered on this game, guys. And he's going to post hook every play. Bully people down low. So that's kind of insane. He could stand dunk. He got quick first step. He got the slippery off ball badge. He got the good pass accuracy. He got good defensive stats. Can rebound. He can set screens. He's strong. This is the best 7-3 build in the game, in my opinion. And shout out to Rainbow for showing me this. This is the build he runs, and he really loves this build. So let's see. We're going to do see the future, see the future, double see the future. So we can see where the where the boards are. 
Let's see who we get. Let's see who we get. Okay, Shaq, Rudy Gobert, Mitchell Robinson. All right, so we got Shaq. That's all I need to see. Glass cleaning finisher, the 7-3 build, the best center build on the game. Let me know what you guys think. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. It's your boy, O'Fab, and I'm out.